Now, uh, residents of Tema East constituency have hit the streets today over the arrest of the NDC parliamentary candidate for the area, Isaac Ashia Odamton. The NDC candidate, who we understand was arrested yesterday, has been invited to appear before the financial court. Atom FM's Isabella Gidiglo Ave joins us on the line for more. Bella, if you can hear me well, um, do we know why the NDC candidate has been arrested? Firstly. Okay. We had information yesterday morning that uh, Honorable Asha Udamson had been invited to appear before financial court at Accra. Later in the day, around 3 p.m., the, thereabouts, we again had information that uh, they had finished with the court process and were heading towards the Mayoko office. Then in the evening, we had another information that Honorable Asha Udamson and some other two who were involved in the Yoko CMA uh, alleged fraud issue had been detained at County 11 p cell because they were not able to meet a bail requirement of 10 million Ghana cities each. Because of this, because of this some NDC youth and uh, NDC party faithful uh, at Tema Newtown embarked on protests on the streets from Tema. Newtown to County 11 police station last night. Others who ended up burning ties at the Newtown Township. As we speak, security personnel, that's military and police, are still in the Newtown Township, ensuring that law and order will be com complied by the residents. All right, many thanks for that update. Uh, Bella <coughs> Ave. Uh, Gidiglo is uh, our Adum FM correspondent in the Tema area. But staying on this story, earlier in the day, uh, the office of the Member of Parliament, the incumbent MP, uh, Daniel Titus Glover, issued a statement on this matter. He said, the office of the MP of the Tema East constituency has been drawn to some allegations made by the Tema East constituency NDC with regards to the arrest of their parliamentary candidate. The case has been referred, the case being referred to is between their candidate versus uh, the Republic of Ghana with respect to some funds alleged to be misappropriated during his tenure as mayor of Tema. The report was carried out by Iyoko and sent to the office of the Attorney General of the Republic of Ghana. All issues with respect to his alleged criminality would be out of place to associate it with the office of the Member of Parliament and Parliamentary Candidate of the New Patriotic Party, Tema East. Honorable Daniel Ni Titus Glover, the Tema East constituency NDC candidate, and nine others are facing trial on six counts of financial criminality during his term as the mayor of Tema. The bill conditions are at the discretion of the Honorable Court of the Republic of Ghana, which has nothing to do with our member of parliament and deputy minister of transport. And that was a statement issued uh, from the office of the Member of Parliament, Tema East Constituency and Deputy Minister of Transport, Daniel Titus Glover, a uh, while ago. Uh, let's go on the line and speak to uh, the Greater Accra Regional Secretary of the NDC, Theophilus Tetechai. Many thanks for your time, sir. So what, what's the party's position on this arrest? Did you know that he had been arrested? Did you know that these uh, charges were filed against him? Uh, thank you very much. Uh, let me say good afternoon to your cherished uh, listeners. Uh, first of all, uh, let me uh, appeal for calm in the Tema East constituency. Um, it is a, a very difficult time for us as a constituent, and definitely with the support that Honorable Nia Shai has in the Tema East constituency, poised to win this election. This has not come to us as a surprise. In fact, um, for over so many months now, the current member of parliament for Tema East, with my good friend, uh, Honorable Daniel Nietzsche Glover, has been uh, saying on air that um, very soon the member or the parliamentary candidate for the NDC will be picked up. So for us, it is not surprising. And when you look at the bill conditions that has been given, it tells you that um, well, the court has taken its decision. We cannot overrule the decision of the court, but we think the decision to uh, slap 10 million as surety for 
his release was very harsh uh, to make it very difficult for bail conditions to be met. But the good people of uh, Tama East are solidly behind Ashai Odamti. The NDC as a political party will always subject itself to the rule of law, probity, and accountability. And as such, the party is doing everything possible to make sure that um, our colleague or the, 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 the parliamentary candidate for the Tama East uh, will be able to meet the bill conditions and then um, he will be brought home to continue with his uh, campaign. But I can assure okay, you... Okay, so um, uh, on a at the time, um, just to cut in, just a minute, I'd yeah. like to clarify. So as we speak, he is in the custody of the police. Is that the case? Currently, he has been taken out of the Tema uh, 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 police custody. And the MBNI has uh, taken him out this morning. So where is, is so where where is he now? Central. Where, which central? Accra Central, Tema Central. Yeah, I, I've been told that uh, they will sent back to the court. Some of our party officials are with him, and they are making sure that the right things will be done. Right. But once again, let me assure the good people of Tema East that we will do everything possible to ensure that the man they cherish to be their member of parliament is brought back to continue with this campaign. Mm. And speaking of campaign, do you think that this is going to affect his chances uh, at winning the, the parliamentary seat, which is just Not some six all. days away? In fact, this has rather uh, geared or uh, made the cons constituent so angry. In fact, he is the person they want to lead the constituency. So the attempt that has been made to smear uh, Honorable Ni Ashai, just to make him unpopular, is something that the good people of the East will not countenance. And that is why you see the demonstrations uh, ongoing in the Tema East constituency. But, like I said, peace is of essence. And as a political party, we want our members to be law abiding. We want to ensure that come December 7th, His Excellency Nana Dodanko Akufuado and some of his corrupt officials will be taken out of office peacefully. So I'm once again appealing to the people of Tema East that they should remain calm and let the rule of law take its course. But whether they like it or not, Ni Ashai Odanti is going to be the member of parliament for Tema East. All right, many thanks for your time. That is the Greater Accra NDC Regional Secretary. That's uh, Theophilus Tetetai there.